and welcome to Reality News Roundup. Here are the top stories of the day. Union Urban Development Minister M. Vainkaya Naidu has asked 20 selected cities to get the projects kicked off by June 25, the day Smart City Mission completes one year of its launch. He said the money allotted for the Smart City projects cannot be used for any other purpose. The minister emphasized that there was no politics in choosing smart cities as many BJP ruled states as well as constituencies represented by many VPIPs did not figure in the list. Private sector lender ICICI Bank took over about 275 acres worth Rs 1800 crore in Noida and Greater Noida from Jayaprakash Associates Limited. The bank's total exposure to the company was Rs 6600 crore at the end of March 2015. Lawyers representing the three arrested corporators in the deceased realtor Suraj Parmar case said that he had shared business interests with political functionaries. They informed the district session court that Parmar was misusing his connections to usurp public plots for personal gain. Carvey Financial Services, the banking finance firm, is mulling to set up a housing finance company, says a business standard report. However, the lender is yet to take the required regulatory approval but is looking at doing so in the next financial year. Essel Financial Advisors and Managers, the private equity arm of the Essel Finance, has launched its second real estate fund. The firm plans to raise up to Rs 250 crore. The fund will be used to invest in residential projects in Delhi NCR, Mumbai, Chennai, Bengaluru and Pune. Thank you for watching. For latest updates, follow us on Facebook, Twitter, YouTube and Instagram.